Hey guys, it's Megan. I have my other video um getting ready to up well it's uploading now, so I figured I'd do another little quick one for you. This isn't gonna be thirty minutes long like the other one was. Um when I got to my parents tonight, my sister was there with her two kids. Um her husband was working and my other youngest sister, I guess we passed her on the road because I think her son had a meltdown and she couldn't get him to calm down, so <coughs> excuse me, they had to wind up leaving. Well, so I come in and um my uh I had to throw some clothes in my mom's dryer because while it was wet, I had a change of clothes with me, so I needed to dry what I had already gotten wet from the rain. Well, <clears throat> I'm sitting there talking to my sister Mandy about um, Big Brother. Well, Mandy's son, who's named Charlie, who's eight years old, and he's got a brother named Alex, who's four. Well, Charlie, I was talking to Mandy about um, Big Brother Season 17 and about the eviction night. Actually, I think she might have started the talking. And I wish Sarah had been there because it would have been funner. But <clears throat> um, talking about eviction night because they had uh, Shelly and Clay up on the block. James had put them up. And um, after, you know, the voting, it was unanimous. Clay got evicted. Well, it's the week before jury. So they said, even though you're out of the house, you may not be out of the game. So, <clears throat> um it's twisted, twist, twisted summer or something. I don't know. Anyways, I'm sitting there talking to Mandy, and all of a sudden, Charlie says, "Well, my favorite guy, my favorite person on Big Brother got evicted." And I'm like, looking down like an eight year old. I'm like, "Who? Jason? I really liked him." <coughs> and of course, my dad hit the roof. He's like, "What are you letting your son watch Big Brother for?" It's just a bunch of half-naked people, and there's no reality in it. It's all scripted, and there's nothing real. Once the cameras are rolling, they're scripted on what they're doing. Well, no, the live feeds, they're not, because if they were, they might come up with some pointers of what to talk about, but they're not scripted on that. On the show, however, when they have to be on there, they are a little bit. They, well, they have to read scripts for some of the cons and events and stuff. <coughs> but, um... My nephew Charlie, I used to watch American Idol, and the year that, um, I think it was a year after Crystal Bowersocks. I think it was the year that had, uh, um, Scott, what's his name? Oh, I can't remember his name. Scott, oh, Scotty McCreary, the year Scotty McCreary was on there. And Charlie told me Scotty McCreary was going to win it. He had it. He's really good. He liked his voice. And he called it, and he was right. So he watches some of the same stuff that, you know, we watch, us adults. But at the same time, if it's inappropriate, he it's put on after he goes to bed. So it's not like he watches everything. My sister does use discretion with him. But it was funny for him to tell me, you know, I like this guy, and he's gone, and, and um... He said, I like the the power of veto competition, and I like the head of household competition, and it's kind of funny listening to an eight-year-old talk about it. So, um, I hope it's not going to be one of those in, you know, ten years, fifteen years, if it's still in the air, that he decides he wants to try out for it. It'd be kind of funny. So, um, yeah, the kids say the darndest things. Um, he just they're just so lovable i love my nephews all of them so anyways little story but yep like fave share subscribe thank you have a good one